He's not from a family of power. Therefore, he's been brought in to personify the Vedic ideal that any person through their merit can rise to any position in society. Isn't this a lesson to democracy also? Right now, democracy in the West is threatened by billionaires and trillionaires whose wealth is giving them political power and influence. This is not what democracy is based on. It's not based on the abusive use of money and resources of that kind. And I know that Narendra Modi is the personification of using those resources in a way that benefits everyone. And the other thing that I know he has is a long view. He is playing the long game, which means he knows that his culture, that the Hindu Vedic culture is having a renaissance and is being revived. So the people who are afraid of him are afraid of libraries, afraid of culture, afraid of diversity, afraid of biodiversity, afraid of ecology, afraid of speaking kindly of everyone, afraid of seeing everyone as an immortal being. What they're really afraid of, many of them, is that when we do see a noble leader who's setting a wonderful example, then we can see the lack of those qualities in the world leadership around us. This is the Vedic way. You teach by your personal example.